Hello, and thank you for watching. My name is Rachel Barnett with Gentle Frog. I'm here to create videos for you to help you understand QuickBooks slightly better than you currently do. If you have any comments, questions, or suggestions, please put them in the chat box. Thank you. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add a team member to your QuickBooks Online accountant account. This only applies if you have QuickBooks Online accountant access and you're adding somebody to your team. What you'll want to do is go to team on the left hand side of your screen. It's then going to show you a list of the people that are part of your team. You're going to select add user in the upper right hand corner. You're going to add their name and their email address. For this example, I'm going to add a friend of mine, Thais Wells. And so I'm adding her to my QuickBooks Online account. I'm going to select next. This screen says, for my firm and administration books, what access would I like to give her? Now, technically, I don't use that part of my QuickBooks, so I don't care what I give her. But you, if you're using QuickBooks Online Accountant, and if you have your own company QuickBooks in QuickBooks Online Accountant, you're going to want this to have the least amount of access. You don't want to have your team members or contract bookkeepers able to see your business QuickBooks file. You'll then select next. On this screen, it defaults to showing you a list of all your clients that you have access to and automatically adding that person to every single client. The first thing I do is uncheck that box. I then search for the client that I intend to add the bookkeeper or team member to. And in this case, I'm going to add Thais to my sample QuickBooks file. So I've just searched for it. I'm going to select that one box. I'm going to choose save in the lower right hand corner. And it says you've added a team member, way to grow. Fantastic. It's just as simple as that. From here, Thais is going to get an email saying she's been invited to join my QuickBooks Online accountant account. When she goes to sign in to QuickBooks Online, she's going to have to pick if she wants to log into her own accounting firm with her own clients or if she wants to log into my accounting firm with my clients. Her login will look something like this. Of course, with her firm showing up in my firm and any other firm she has access to, this is the approach that you'll take when working with a staff bookkeeper or contract bookkeeper. Again, if you're a small business owner adding somebody to your QuickBooks Online, this isn't the right video for you. We definitely have other videos for that. For all the bookkeepers out there, I hope this has been helpful. If there's anything that I can do for you, please don't hesitate to let me know. Thank you so much and have a great day.